So what I wanted to do in this video is to show kind of the anatomy of a successful momentum breakout. This is the uh, E-mini S&P that we're going to look at, and we're going to see really a massive breakout that, that happens, which is really cool. Uh, it's actually a successful breakout. Many breakouts fail. This one actually succeeds. So one thing that you can notice over here as you look at the, uh, the volume, you can see that uh, the big the big orders they're starting to get stacked up and and you can see a whole bunch of big orders start to flow through and you can see the little orders that's one of the things that's really cool about this product is it, it just shows not only things as they're setting up but as they're coming in it can highlight for you just strong strong momentum so right here we've got really strong momentum um, a lot of buyers big big buyers coming in here probably worth taking a you know just based on momentum you can just enter enter an order right here and you can see here that there's just quite a bit of volume going on you can see over here in the uh, depth and sales you know that the buyers are holding firm sellers are also you know trying to hold firm as, as much as possible they're adding to contracts but there's just not a lot of depth and you can kind of see them start to give way again you can start seeing um, the massive numbers of contracts flowing through. Look at the strength meter, how it just kind of um, is just overwhelmingly on the long side. And yet there are still opportunities for you to get in on the close of that bar, even as you saw this momentum happen and this momentum taking place. So you can see here all the, the prints that are happening. The bears are really trying to stop this momentum as they're flowing in. But you can see orders getting pulled you can see orders continue to get firmed up on uh, on the bid side. Offers are getting pulled. Uh, you still have some big players coming in. And you know, just look at these numbers. You know, down here at at 4650, uh, 2,083 prints on the buy side, compared to 1,352 on the sell side, and then the next level up. 4675 you had 838 longs compared to 80 shorts and you see this all the way up with the exception of this one area where it's pausing uh, 4750 you've got 900 plus shorts 300 455 longs and boom now we have a, a switch so the, the bulls are taking over they're gonna push through this area so even if you got in way back when you know at the close of that strong bull bar which was 4650. You've already got your four ticks. Uh, you can probably move to break even, and uh, we can actually see where this thing's going to go.